Things could be worse, such as my job pain. <laughs> Michael Strahan's daughter Isabella is sharing another day in her life during chemotherapy. The video is the 10th installment of her YouTube video series where she's been sharing her health journey following her brain tumor diagnosis in 2023. In the vlog, the 19-year-old takes us with her as she goes to physical therapy after her first round of chemotherapy. <laughs> See when you have uh, moving objects that you have to balance over. <laughs> she also opens more Valentine's Day gifts and handmade letters from the Scarlet Fund, which raises awareness for pediatric cancer research. This one's cool. Look up. Oh. This looks like a card I would make. <laughs> I feel like this is like great color paper too. Plus she shares what a day in her life looks like as she recovers. Like two days ago, I didn't leave my room, I don't think. So I was severe, I had a fever. But like, so you're supposed to go to the hospital if you have 100.4 twice, but mine was 100.2. So that means I didn't have to go. And it went down, but I felt so awful. So I just stayed in bed. Um, usually my days, so everyone's at college, <laughs> so it's really just me here. Um, two doctor's appointments. I have two doctor's appointments per week to get my blood drawn. I had one yesterday, and I actually don't mind getting my blood drawn anymore. I take it back. <laughs> things could be worse, such as my job pain. <laughs> Those are the only set things I have per week besides maybe physical therapy, which I have today. On February 21st, Michael Strain shared an update on his daughter while on Good Morning America, noting that she is fighting through her treatment after having a small setback that landed her back in the hospital. She's fighting through it, and uh, you know, last last three days have been a little rough because she had a fever that kind of comes and goes. So have a fever, had to take her to the hospital. Thought she'd come home a few hours later. She said, "I thought it was going to be here for two hours. Was well, been three days, but hopefully she'll be home today." And how are you? I'm good. I'm good. I got, you know, I got you guys here support me and I know we so many people have gone through it who all we all reach out and send their love and send their support and I don't think anything has happened that we haven't expected. Nothing happened that she hasn't expected, but it is tough to see her go through it, but I know she's a tough young lady and she's mm -hmm. going to make what it through. What an attitude she has. Yeah, yeah, she really does. Great attitude. And the attitude of wanting to share and I know that she is helping to raise funds yeah. through her vlog. And I think for her for so many people who reached out and said, you know, I'm glad you're doing this. Thank you for doing this. Mm -hmm. This has really helped us and and, and all that support that she's getting from people she doesn't know on top of people that she does know mm. has, has kept her in a very positive space. All right. So thank you to everybody.